All right, we're here at countyimports.com. We're gonna film the 110cc and 150cc power buggy from BMS. Uh, I just kinda wanna show you guys size from the 110 to the 150 so you get an idea of the difference, okay? I think we pretty much got the understanding that one dwarfs the other, okay? The size is pretty considerable, even on the tires. You got the rear end, of both okay now on the 110 here this video is going to show first off starting with the tires you got 16 by 8 by 7 complemented on the front looks like we have a uh, 16 excuse me a 145 uh, 76 and uh, their standard three bolt pattern in the front with the uh, four uh, this one also has a three bolt pattern in the rear as well so you can kind of interchange um, this is a uh, powder coated frame. Everything's shift linkage when it comes to uh, the, ref it has forward, neutral, and reverse. So when you read three speed, that's what that means. Forward, neutral, reverse. There's no clutch, it's semi-automatic. Okay. Front independent wishbone suspension. See, you can adjust everything, it's all adjustable. Front link linkage control, all adjustable. On the gas pedal, it looks like we have a speed restrictor that you can set. This goes up and sets the speed, it appears. Okay, on how fast, well that's, excuse me, that's the, uh, that's the brake. The gas right there, see the bolt down below? hitting the bottom you can adjust that on how fast you want your child to be able to accelerate this vehicle the brake I'm not quite sure what this is but uh, look in the description and we'll have a, a descript uh, a breakdown of what this means I believe this is the parking brake I think you can actually set this with this notch and keep it from rolling while it's in storage that's what makes most sense to me we got steel braided lines on this little guy not bad for a little 110 go-kart this little thing's fast. I had it going about 25 miles an hour. The acceleration is uh, pretty impressive. Here's the rear end. We've got uh, everything self-contained. We got a small Canon style air filter with carburetor right next to it. The idle adjustment screw right there for you. Here's the idle adjustment for the gas pedal. Easy access to your starter. Your rear chain. If you throw a link, you can at least access it. You don't have to take the whole thing apart to get to it. Rear disc brake. Cross drilled. Rear disc brake. Easy change. There's that linkage again for you on the uh, shifter right into the engine. There's no cables, no chances that your child's going to accidentally snap a cable. Uh, here we go again with the uh, cross, uh, excuse me, the braided, steel braided lines. Easy access to your CDI, your rectifier. You can change those out if need be. You got a fuel shut off safety switch here. Okay, gas tank's metal. Little safety net in the rear. Cool thing that I noticed when I was riding this, I'm six feet, 185 pounds. And as silly as it may sound, an adult should not obviously ride this all the time, but if you do need to demonstrate something for your child, uh, the way that they've set the roll cage up on this, you can actually still sit in it as an adult. Your head pokes out the top a little bit, maybe looks a little funny, but the fact is, is that you can get inside and use and ride this thing around and show your child uh, you know, how to turn, how to stop, how to ride with you. Uh, but yet the roll cage is still there. And what I wanted to point out is that this roll cage can actually be taken off. I'm not going to recommend it, obviously, but it can be done in the front and in the rear, and you can almost make this like a little power cart. Or more importantly, if you accidentally bend, <coughs> excuse me, bend the roll cage, you can remove it, fix it, and replace it. So you're not stuck with a bent roll cage if something was to happen. Uh, and so into the safety features, we've got nice harness point seat belts. Dual seat belts you're gonna notice here. So it's made for a two passenger, smaller rider. The seat, however, does not move up and down. It's not that big. It doesn't need to be adjusted. And the measurements of this seat 
from the back of the seat to the gas pedal and from the front of the seat to the gas pedal are going to be listed on the item description. So if you click the link down below, it'll take you to our website where you can actually see the dimensions. But uh, being that I have a 10 year old son, he fits in here just fine. And my little six year old would fit in here just the same. So we're going to go ahead and move on to the 150. This is the 110 cc fully automatic three speed. You have forward, neutral and reverse. Power Cart from CountyImports.com. If you have any questions, pick up the phone, contact our staff, 877-868-5828. And uh, subscribe to this video, and thanks for stopping by, guys.